finally time. I know that I am uh, two days. I know I'm two days behind on this, but it is finally time for me to react, live react, and do a review, and also thank Ichiro Oda for creating such a wonderful series that, you know, we are finally here at chapter 1000. It's an amazing milestone, and honestly, at the end of this video, I will have a thank you Oda message um, as many of the other One Piece YouTubers have done and a lot of people did on Twitter um, pretty much uh, on Sunday I am fortunately I could not um, do this on Sunday when it officially released and either on uh, yesterday on Monday uh, I couldn't I didn't have any time to do it either so I'm doing it today um, but we are going to be getting in to uh, chapter 1000. We're finally here. I still can't believe it. Um, that we are now at this wonderful milestone with a really, really good chapter title called Straw Hat Luffy. Literally the name of the main character. All right. Let's get into this, and then I'll go. Also, I would like to, before this stream slash video starts, I am also going to thank um, the person who wonderfully made this, my new stream out um, outline here, and it is, um, uh, it is thanks to, uh, it is thanks to Dedic, uh 281 on Fiverr. I um, normally you can uh, I use Fiverr um, for some of my things. Um, so my intro, um, the stream set, uh, uh, the stream uh, layout. Um, I'm also getting a new outro being made, um, and um, my YouTube uh, banner and all that. They have all been done by people off of Fiverr, so I highly recommend, not sponsored by the way, but I highly recommend um, that, you know, you guys go check out Fiverr, see what um, you might like from there, and if you're being a content creator, you might find some cool things, and you might get some good results like I have. Um, so, here we go. Inside the castle, fifth floor. Oh. This is about the only thing. Uh, we can do to help but go ahead the stairs to the roof are just be before you minks dormstog three musketeers oh that's cool okay cool uh thanks lion viper it's shishilian oh he calls him lion <laughs> nice one luffy it's shishilian uh, don't worry, I haven't forgotten. I remember. How you guys risk your lives to protect Rizo. Thanks, I'll be back. Damn it, what's with his power? Blah, blah, blah. Damn it, what's with his power? His powers. Is he invincible? It's a uh, queen and king fighting Marco. Cool, cool, nice. Alright. Easy now, easy. Stop freaking out and let the man go. Uh, don't just toss me. <laughs> Marco just throws Zoro. Nice. Did, and this is in my father's journal? Yamato. Um, honestly, I never truly believed that I would get the chance to meet you. This is for you, of course. I picked it up. Um, out of the river at the foot of Odin Castle on that terrible day. Someone must have kept this journal safe from the Burning Castle. It contains everything that uh, there is to know about Odin's grand life and the world he experienced. Lord Odin's journal. Father. Oh, Lawn Kid. Alright, here we go. Here we go. We were born... Oh, wait a minute. Okay, never mind. <laughs> Okay. You were born on Whitebeard's ship, weren't you? And then you went on Roger's ship. 
they said that in the future, over 20 years later, the new world here would be overrun by young, powerful new pirates, Law and Kid and Luffy. And that's what's happening now. I believe that Ace was the first and foremost among them. But when he died, I remembered something. Shoot, that was a slip of the tongue. I wasn't supposed to say that. You didn't hear that. Forget about it. Uh, anyway, don't laugh, uh, at me. Er, don't laugh at that. Me and Sabo won't allow it. Huh? That's at the end of my little brother's dream. The one, the, the one piece. He was talking about the one piece. He had to have been. He had to have been. Right? Right? Surely. Surely he had to have. Um... Sure, when Luffy first said it, we laughed, but that's okay. No one, el no one else can laugh. We believe in him. I really think he can make it happen. And that's why... Ace, huh? Hey, what's the deal, Yamato? I'm not going to laugh at him. Those are the words the King of the Pirates spoke. Words that stunned Odin. In the Journal of Kozuki Odin, there was a great man who said the same thing. Of course, I wouldn't laugh at him. Your brother is incredible. Oh yeah? A great man, huh? That's good to hear. Maybe one day me and Luffy should sit down with him for a drink. <laughs> I bet that one. Uh, you wouldn't. You would have gotten along. Would have? Well, he's already dead. You're talking about a dead guy? There, it's done. It's your Viver card. Huh? It's just a piece of paper. Yes, but that piece of paper will bring us together again. Tear off a bit of it and give it to your friends and don't, uh, you don't want to lose track of. Or people you'll want to meet again. Oh. Let's meet up again one day, Ace. You bet. And then one day, Ace's card just disappeared. Shortly after that, I learned the truth from the newspaper. I learned that Ace was Roger's son, and that he, his little brother, really made a name for himself as a pirate. That was Luffy, the man you brought here. This is what Odin wrote about the future. Ooh, big... Okay. Okay. Oh, God. All right. Big, big, uh, big spread. Big spread. Oh, God. Okay. So, Luffy makes it to the top. And here's another one. All of you, stay back and watch me fight. Straw Hat. All these fetching uh, young heads ripe for the taking. So that was Kaido and, and Big Mom talking. Over 20 years in the future, powerful pirates leading the, new gen the next generation will come swarming into the new world. If I am dead by then, they will be the ones to strike down Kaido. Kid, Killer, Luffy, Zoro, and Law. Damn. Nice. Uh. Luffy. Uh. Hmm? Lin Lin. Can you guess what this boy said he would become right to my face? Oh, he's a saucy. What the hell? He's a saucy one. He talked a big game to me too, and he destroyed my castle. You owe me an apology for that, Straw Hat. Huh? He... He literally just walked right past Ka... Oh, he literally walked right past Kaido and Big Mom. Oh, okay. Hey boy, say it again. Tell us what you're gonna be right here. Uh, where we can hear you. Luffy walks over to Ken uh, Kinemon. Uh, you alright, Kinemon? I'm sorry it took me so long. He's coughing up blood, and Luffy looks over, sees all the, uh, samurai. Oh. Alas, when I pass on, I have nothing to show Lord Odin, but my shame. Will you put Wano on your back? God, why am I crying? <laughs> yeah, why am I crying? It was bad enough with the My Hero chapter. Now I got this. 
<clears throat> I'm not really like like I know it's emotional, and like I'm invested in these characters, but like. Oh, God damn it. Alright. Of course I will. It's my friend's country. Kinemon's crying. Kaido says, hey boy. Kinemon says, sir Luffy. And then Luffy tells uh, Law to send them all below. And he does. Alright. He dodges out of Kaido's way. Okay. Gear third, gum gum. Rizo is alive and well. Flashbacks. Oh, flashbacks. Okay. Ryzo is alive and well. He would never sell a comrade to an enemy. I want to defeat Kaido. We crossed through time to arrive here from the Wano of 20 years ago. The friendly oddball of Ebisu Town shall make the final grand journey. The fire of rebellion still burns. The sparks have not gone out. Lord Odin, be uh, beloved by all, was taken to the flower capital as a criminal, tried and executed. Okay, Luffy's doing a... Red Rock? I mean, that's what it's translated to, okay. Oh, oh, here we go. So Luffy has a new technique, and he just slammed the hell out of Kaido. <laughs> and then... Big Mom, Kaido, what are you doing? How could you let him hit you like that? And then, I am Monkey D. Luffy. And I'm the man who will surpass you to be king of the pirates. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. Um. Alright. I can see how... Okay. Now that I've finally done the... Live reaction part to the chapter itself. Let's move on to my review. So, I can see how there are some conflict, conflicting, you know, viewpoints of this chapter because, you know, the nine red scabbards are pretty much knocked out, almost like dead un and unconscious and whatever. And then. Luffy tells Law to send them below to literally just get them out of here. And, you know, which I understand that, you know, it was their sacrifice to fight Kaido. And the fact that they look like this now. Um, and then just the fact that Luffy is like, all right, let's let's get them out of here. And that's what Law does. Um, you know, I can I can see the conflicting factors here and I understand it um, because, you know, this is a war, a lot of people are going to die, and the fact that now we are s literally potentially saving nine people in an instant, it, it does make sense that there are some conflicting factors here. Um, but I do think overall it is a really good, really good chapter with the f with, with some of the other viewpoints, like the, still part of the ace, uh, ace flashback, the fact that um, Kid, Killer, Zoro, and Law are already, um, on the roof, and Luffy shows up, that's really cool, um, the, one of the funny parts that I liked was that Luffy literally walks right past Kaido and Big Mom just to go see, Ki uh, Kinemon. like, there are still some really good parts of this, uh, chapter, even Luffy's new gear, th uh, gear third uh technique move like there is still um uh like there are still some really good points that happen in this chapter so i can i can see why there are some good and bad viewpoints of this chapter but then again it is chapter 1000 it still has an overarching title of chapter 1000 um and that's just what's really good um so now on to uh i'm pretty sure yeah that, that's pretty much my review point of that um of this chapter um it is good i really like it um luffy gets a new technique um he literally um says to kaido and big mom that he will surpass them as the pirate king which is you know 
obviously his overall dream. Um, and the uh, just the the big big spread. I really love uh, page ten and eleven with the big spread with um, the um, the supernovas. Pretty much what they are. The supernovas plus uh, or versus Kaido and Big Mom. That, that's a really good, really good picture. Uh, really good panel. Um, but now that I have finally read chapter 1000 and you've heard my viewpoints, let me go on to thank Oda. All right. So let's, let's go, let's go back a little bit. Um, so I started One Piece a lot later than many people. Um, the anime came out in 1999. That was actually the year I was born. So, I, you know, obviously, I haven't been around watching One Piece for that long, since all 21 years of my birth. Um, but, I can say that I got into it a whole lot later. Um, by a whole lot later, I mean by high school. Um, and not just that, but around my junior to senior year of high school. Um, that is when I started watching uh, One Piece, uh, because my friend told me for a while, he's like, hey, you need to watch One Piece, it's really good, and I was like, alright, I'll do it, um, I knew that it already had like so many episodes already, so I was like, you know what, I'll do it, I'll binge watch it, sure, it's fine, I can do that, I can watch 25 episodes in a day, no worries, um, which, um, that is also kind of why I was able to get caught up was because I was watching 25 episodes a day sometimes. Sometimes I was watching 25 episodes 25 episodes a day and sometimes I was watching it at least like 4 to 5 episodes a day. So like I, I was still getting my fair share of One Piece uh, anime. Um, I did not start reading the manga until chapter 900 um, because what was going on was in the manga Whole Cake Island just ended um, in the manga, and Whole Cake Island in the anime was still going. So I was caught up with the anime, meaning I was watching Whole Cake Island. And the fact that Chapter 900 was coming out, and I was like, all right, you know, since, you know, 900 is the end of Whole Cake Island, I'll start reading from there, and then um, I'll just watch it in the anime. And that's what I did. Um... So, what I did was, I have read from chapter 900 to chapter 1000. Um, so, it, it, it's a big, big step for me um, being, you know, invested in anime and, you know, manga and stuff like that. Um, and I can um, say that I, I'm invested. I really like One Piece. Um, my viewpoint of it has changed a lot, um, from the very beginning. I thought, like, it's a good series, it's okay, and then the time skip happened, and then I was like, okay, this is really cool, this is a good series. Um, granted, the time skip for the anime is, like, 500 episodes, but whatever. Um, I did, however, upload a video on how to get caught up to the One Piece anime, so that way it's easier for people to get caught up to One Piece and stuff like that. Um, with that way, um, but pretty much, you know, Ichiro Oda, you have created a wonderful, wonderful series that has changed many people's lives over the years, um, including my own. Um, it, 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 it's it, it's a story about dreams and realizing those dreams and trying to get, um, you know answers to your unsolved dreams or something like that um and i can safely say that um this has changed my perspective on life sometimes that you know there are risks that need to be taken and um just other other things that you know need to be said and done and it's it's just amazing. It's wonderful. Um, 
it it has made more of an impact than I thought it would. Um, just on the fact that this journey is so long and there is still more for it to come. And I know that it is going to end in a really good way. Um, it, it It's just, it, you know, it makes me, um, you know, realize that there are things that um, are still left unanswered. And I'm hoping that we can get some of it answered um, uh, before the series ends. And um, pretty much, it's, it's all just... Thank you, Oda, for creating this amazing series for pretty much your whole life and sharing it with the world and uh, impacting so many people. Um, so thank you for making this amazing series and reaching chapter 1000 and to probably another some some chapter. I'm not I'm not going to name a number because we, we we don't know. We're definitely not going to make it to 2,000. I know that much. Um, but, you know, if we did, that'd be cool. But if not, which is most likely not going to happen, you know, just thank you for making such an amazing series, and I will continue to read it. Um, so, thank you. And thank you guys for watching this video slash stream event. Um, this was live streamed, um, but I have edited it into a video uh, for you guys, so that way there are some things that I needed to input into here of, you know, doing some editing stuff. But thank you guys for watching this video. If you did, please hit that thumbs up button. Leave some comments down below on what you guys thought of the chapter. And um, if you're new to my channel, please hit the subscribe and notification bell. I don't know where I'm going to put it on here. Just hit the subscribe button and notification bell to be notified anytime I upload a new video, and I will see you guys next time.